Hello everyone, my name is Basir Khan and in this video I'm going to be showing you guys how to code using your mobile phone. So for that all you guys have to do is to go to Play Store and in Play Store you have to write down decoder. decoder compiler id code and programming on mobile so you can code on your mobile phone i'm going to install this app and after installing this app i will show you how you can code using a couple of languages you can even code in javascript php c c plus plus python rust and rest other languages so this app allows you to write code and then run that code using your mobile phone once the app is installed and it is ready i will open it and then i will show you guys how to write code using decoder So now it is installed. I will open it. Okay. Okay, as a developer, I'm going to use it. I'm going to cross it. Now, I will start coding by pressing the le the right bottom button. Once I press it, it shows couple of languages option. I will select any language from the shown options I will select first JavaScript and Node.js as my language I will give file name in which I will write code JS testing create H hello decoder will be shown on the bottom hello decoder you guys can see hello decoder now if I change the code hello this here it will show hello this here in terminal so now if I write some more code I'm going to declare a variable a and I'm going to assign 20 to this variable now I will check if a is equal to 20 then console dot log dot log I will write down message inside double quotation
else show message console dot log variable is not equivalent to is not equal to 20 so if I run the code it will show message 20 you guys can see message on the bottom of the screen variable value is 20 now if I change the value of variable in here then the else section will be executed and a message will be shown in the terminal so if I run it again you guys can see message shown on the terminal so if you try one more language but before that you guys can use the switch to read mode option in which you guys can see just the code and you cannot edit any code line in here in this mode you cannot change any code line right if I go back to the edit editing mode in here you guys can edit your code according to your own choice so you guys can make available this code publicly and if you want to upload this code you guys can use this option you guys can share the code with anyone using that option okay you you right and if I you if I select some other language from the list shown on your on the screen well let me use PHP this time PHP testing I'm going to give a file name PHP testing this time and if I proceed some default code lines will be shown on your screen if I execute the code it will show hello decoder and if I once again change the displayed message by changing the echo double quoted text inside uh, double quoted text you guys can see message accordingly if I run it again you guys can see message as I, I edited so I can write any code in here decoder editor is supporting PHP the test version 7.3.0 and you guys can use let uh, latest syntax according to PHP 7.3.0 on this editor so if I go back and select any other language from these shown languages you guys can write that language code using decoder so decoder supports couple of languages whenever you are out of outside and you guys think about some logic and then that logic comes inside your mind and you think that this like this logic is you know 
problem solving then you can write code at that place and you can execute and verify your logic either it is working or not so for now it is enough and for the next video keep watching my channel and if you have learned a bit from this video please hit the subscribe button and hit the share button as well so that I can make more and more videos like this for you guys thank you keep watching my channel bye bye